Gary, I'm, I'm sure the word disappointment doesn't come close to your thoughts at the moment. What's your reaction to defeat at East Thurrock? Yeah, bitterly disappointed. Um, the scoreline suggests that also, you know, that um, we were no near, nowhere near good enough. We didn't defend uh, well enough. Um, and it's an un unacceptable uh, display. What, what was key to Thurrock's victory this afternoon? I think the first goal was always key. Um, once they'd scored it, they had something to hang on to. Um, but our, our overall performance wasn't um, nowhere near it, really. The scoreline, as I say, the scoreline tells you that. The team it seemed to start pretty well, had the better of the early stages. It's easy to say that first goal is, is key. If, if the shots had got it, it might be different. Yeah, look, we had possession. We had a real good chance with Shamir's header. Um, you have to take them chances. You know, you get the first goal and it has a different, uh, puts a different complexion on the game totally. But um, look, we can't even fill the bench. Um, we're getting lads who are throwing up at half time. Ill. I've got a phone call last night. Someone wasn't wasn't well. Um, we've got loads of players out injured. You can say I'm using an excuse. Yeah, I'm using them as it, uh, as an excuse because that's what it is. That's how we how we are at the moment. Um, we're playing players back in the team are not 100% fit. We're playing. Um, we haven't got a striker, an out and out striker. We haven't got a left back. Um, but in saying all of that, we had good enough players on the field to play today to be able to get a, a result and not taking anything away from East Sarek at all. Um, but in the cold light of day, what I just said is is for real. That's what we're dealing with, and we've had to deal with that for not today, but for for months. It was already a depleted squad and yeah. then during the week you lost Callum Reynolds yeah. and James Rowe in particular, yeah. I guess. That's their two key players. Yeah, well, they, they're key players and you know, I had to take Manny off. I was worried that he was going to get a red card. Um, Renz is out. Look, there's a, there's a list as long as my arm. Um, and it's frustrating. I'm not lying. It's frustrating as hell because we've not been in a position to be able to, to pick what we consider our strongest team or be in a position where we can rotate players and, and freshen things up like like we've been able to do previously. Um, in the cold light of day, that's what we're dealing with. But as you've said, that, that team out there was, was still one that if it was in a National League game, yeah. people would be confident that the team would be able to go out and get a result. Yeah, but they didn't perform. So, um, you know, during the course of any season, you know, I said it last week, we had a bad day at the office and you have spells during the course of the season. But the only way to get out of them spells is to, to work hard. Did we work hard enough? Did we give enough? Did the players get to the levels that they should do? You best ask them. <laughs> I will try. Do you think that was that that desire, that work rate, they were key factors in the defeat? We had pos uh, possession, but we had possession without any penetration or purpose. Uh, and we were a possession based team. But that's um, that's my responsibility. I'll take the score. That's, that's on my neck uh, and my shoulders. That's, that's down to me. I get that. But um, you know, the players, they, the players have to take responsibility also. And um, we just had a chat in there, and you know, I've been honest with the players, so they know where they stand. We said it last week. It's teams are always going to have bad runs. They're always going to have bad results. It's how you respond to it. That now is that now even more important to get a response up at Geisley next week. We're going to a very difficult, uh, going into a very difficult fixture, with uh, the problems that we've got, uh, injury-wise, selection-wise, on the back of today, on the back of last week, um, going into a real busy Christmas New Year period, and we can't freshen it up because we haven't got the the bodies to be able to do that. We're re relying on the players that perform today, and previously we would be able to uh, rotate. Uh, rotate the team around and keep everybody on their toes and a bit of competition. Unfortunately, we haven't got that competition at present. Thank you, Gary. Safe journey home. Thank you.